Hello and welcome to another brand new episode of Dope or No. I'm your host, Matthias, joined by Samantha in the hot seat. Hey. <laughs> hey. Sam found 10 products from the strange side of Etsy. Oof, yes I did. And you might have thought you knew what the strange side was, which is like, oh, that's a goofy looking fidget spinner. Some googly eyes on a phone case. You know, it's so strange. No, you have no idea. Idea. The absurdity and the absolute strangeness of the products that Sam has found. I'm assuming. <laughs> ah, no! <laughs> this is Sid energy, bro! I don't like that! I hate my life. Everything is meaningless. That's what it says. <laughs> Why are people buying toenails? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Realistic human thumbtacks. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, they look so real! That is like fantastic craftsmanship though. Every product is gonna be the case of, yeah, but what if you applied yourself to like real skills? <laughs> <laughs> hey, these are real skills, you know? <laughs> Evidently, I'm wrong because this site says 304 sales. That's not nothing. You bunch of weirdos. <laughs> <laughs> They're just thumbs, dude. I don't know what to tell you. Perfectly morbid and delightful. Would definitely buy again. Are you running out of these? I love these. Was looking for some creepy bookmarks for Halloween. How is this a bookmark? I was looking for some great body piercings. What? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I got so scared. <laughs> All right, let's add the cart. Bro, sorry, you almost hit the I, keyboard, I'm Sam! Sorry, I'm sorry, You almost stopped all recording. <laughs> this is well closed. I've got a knife. I always have a knife on. This guy unboxes things. Well, the knife is more for self-defense than unboxing, but well, I end up using it more for unboxing <laughs> yeah. than self-defense. <laughs> yeah, I would imagine. <laughs> so that's right. <laughs> Think you're gonna surprise me in Trader Joe's? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I just met a fan of Trader Joe's. He was like, yo, I used to watch you all the time. And then I was like, not anymore. Yeah. <laughs> And then he's like, oh, school and work and, you know, other YouTubers. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> this is tiny. Oh, there's like little stamps of fingers. Sam, what do you want to use this for? Oh, that's so strange. <laughs> that gave me bad vibes, bro. Oh. There's fingerprints on it. No, they give them personalities. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, what are we gonna do with this? Oh, we're gonna test them. We're gonna write a little note, put it on this board, and see how well they stab. Put your signature so people know you wrote it. <sighs> nice, now we can sell it. <laughs> Get five bucks on Etsy. <laughs> Try to sell it to that one guy at Trader Joe's. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Uh, uh, sorry. I said I used to watch. <laughs> yeah, I'm not that big of a fan anymore. <laughs> I faced it towards you. Oh, why'd you do that? <laughs> I don't like that it's looking at me. Do you have pliers? I want to break it off. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh there's an actual thumbtack in there. Oh. <laughs> I feel like it's like a child's thumb. Oh, yeah. that makes well, it like, so much worse. I'm sorry, but like, look at like the thumbnail size comparison. It's not your pinky toe, it's the next size toe. These are toes? And then there were thumbs. No, these are definitely toes. <laughs> That makes it worse. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. Here's what we're doing for this video. This toe is going on this pedestal because this pedestal will award the strangest product of the entire video as the strangest product we could find on Etsy. Whatever is stranger moving forward will replace that item on the pedestal. Stay tuned to the end to find which is the strangest one that wins. <laughs> Made it stand up. <laughs> <laughs> what? No! Why so much toe stuff? Uh, first off, the first thing was a thumb. I don't know why this exists on the internet. Sam. What? 13,000 sales. Y'all are a bunch of weirdos. Real big toenails in glass vial, toenail clippings, natural history. Natural, natural history? What? <laughs> okay. Alter decor. What are you praying to? This is gonna be so dangerous when you can start cloning people in a couple of years. <laughs> yeah. All these toenails are gonna be out there. Do you think people like, I'm not gonna say it. Sure. I'm gonna leave that to myself. Yeah, I think with a <laughs> lot of these products, let's not question why someone would purchase it. Well, I hope someone's not using me as some way to get the products that they want without it being on their credit card. Oh, yeah. No, oh, I get the bit now. I get the bit. Yeah, I mean, oh yeah, totally, Matt. I I, I just wanted these toenails for myself. Yeah, okay, add the card. I'm gonna be very gentle with this as to not break the 
the vial or the toenails. Can you break no. to- Oh, no. <laughs> I'm gonna throw this knife away. Oh my gosh, there's toenails in there. Uh, oh no! Oh, it's no! open! It's open! It's out! Close it! Leave the toenails in the bottle. <laughs> Why did this get stuck? Quick, seal it. Bro, we just released some sort of seal voodoo it. energy in here. I don't want to touch it! Cursed toenails. Oh, it's like operation over here. Oof. It's sealed. Oh, there's two in here. I yeah. wish that this came with those like Build-A-Bear profile sheets where it's like, you know, <laughs> whose toes are these? And where did these toenails come from? This yeah. is clearly Janet's toenails. <laughs> yeah. Because you could tell that they're relatively taken care of. I don't know what people do with this. Why are I... people buying toenails? I don't know, man. Witchcraft or just to be quirky. Just to be different? Just to yeah. be like, I have some toenails. And yeah. then you're like, I like being weird. I like being a, a, a outcast of society. Sure. It's like you're leaning too hard into that energy. <laughs> I'm gonna say it's a definite nope, and I'm gonna definitely say it is absolutely, without a doubt, stranger than the thumb. I agree. Replace it. Mm, it's like the changing of the guards. Bro. Dude. My hands just twitch, no joke. <laughs> I feel like Indiana Jones over here. Yeah. yeah, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Next product. Chicken daddies. <laughs> Chicken Daddy's wall calendar. I was thinking about getting you like, you know, sexy firemen or something like that, but Chicken Daddy's. It's men wearing matching tutus with their chickens. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see the chicken. The chickens are matching. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm just not ready for this video today. <laughs> Look at all the pretty chickens. They just match it with the little chickens. This is so uncomfortable. <laughs> is this a gag gift? It's like a silly little gift. Okay, it's laughs are guaranteed, thing. especially love that they made my brother-in-law uncomfortable. <laughs> oh my goodness, all the men in this are like somewhat notable. TV reporter from Oregon, TikTok oh. influencer. Speechless. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Do you want to look at it? Can you rephrase that question? <laughs> are you ready to Are you ready to hold these chicken daddies in your hands? <laughs> Please try again. Uh, are you ready to have this calendar in your possession? No. Well, get ready, because <laughs> here it comes. <laughs> Are you gonna put this on your uh, your wall, Sam? I honestly would. I find it so funny. They all look so happy. No one's addressed the tutus. I think it's just so they can wear something easy to match with the chickens. Because I don't know that you can put like pants on a chicken, you know? Chicken daddies has nothing to do with their battery. attire. And they could have put more thought into the theme, I think. <laughs> You know, if I was directing this calendar... <laughs> Sam, I don't think they could have put less thought into this. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Get ready to get chicken daddy. What's your... When's your birthday? Shut up. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> you guys got a nice mustache. I think these are their chickens, which is cute. No, there's no way. Do you really think this is like their... That's this guy's chicken? Is this some like subgenre of chicken ownership? Why the tutus? Do you have to have a tutu to be a chicken daddy? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you could do like matching overalls. My goodness. Let's skip to your birth month. I want to see your oh. birth month chicken daddy. I do want to see my birth month. Birth month. I do. Want You're something you want to tell me? <laughs> Honestly, a little underwhelming. I appreciate the smile. Here we go for mine. Elegant. <laughs> I'm not gonna show all of the pictures. Some uh, do show some pretty high thigh. What? This might be stranger than the toenails, but I'm not really? sure. This is a part of someone's literal body. Yeah, I think you're right. I think the toenails win. The fact that they know that it's for a laugh yeah. makes it a little less strange. Yeah, it's a bit more of a gag gift. Do you have like a match? Do I have a match? Like, no! Just a I want the chicken daddies. <laughs> I said what I said. Okay. I don't know how you're gonna explain that to Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Next product. <laughs> Absent father action figure? What? It's literally, there's just nothing in the box. That's so sad. Hey, you gotta have a sense of humor about some things, you know? Hilarious and true. Awesome. <laughs> You know, hey, the best comedy has a little bit of truth in it. Father not included. Oh my goodness gracious, add the cart. Here we go, guys. 
<laughs> what the heck, dude? Oh, not that photo. Won't play with you, won't remember your birthday, doesn't care at all. This is harsh, dude. Yeah. <laughs> not recommended for anyone who doesn't understand what it's like to have a father or who just doesn't care. I hate my life, everything is meaningless. That's what it says. <laughs> Oof, this is a real energy killer for the room right now. <laughs> this is... <laughs> this is depresso. I don't know, guys. Do you think this is funny? <laughs> do you not have a father and think this is funny? Or do you not have a father and you're like, tasteless? I don't know. It's one of those things where I feel like the idea of it is funny, but seeing it here in person, <laughs> yeah. I'm like, who would you give this to? Yeah. What would you do with this? It is a note. Yeah. <laughs> I still think it's less strange than that, though. I do, too. <laughs> Rubber lips. <laughs> Breathe. Just a brief. Rubber lips, wall hanging art object. Oh, that gives me the heebie jeebies. Do you put things in it? You probably put your keys in it. You can put your keys in it? Uh, whatever you need to just like hang there on the wall and then come back and get later. There's something about these products that like, no offense guys, but like if you <laughs> had this, I wouldn't be your friend. Some people like ugly, you know what I'm saying? That is true. So maybe that's my entire audience though. People that like uh, like ugly. It's <laughs> so strange, dude. It's just too weird, dude. My question is, are you searching for this? The person that made this also made tentacle stuff and like baby caterpillars. I I'm gonna add to cart. Mounting screw and painted cigarette enclosed. Bro, they packaged this well though. Wow, it's made well. I just wish the lips were a different color. Can it hold my knife? Get in your mouth! <laughs> no, not really. I can really only hold this cigarette. <laughs> is that it? Is it like a lipstick holder? Lipstick holder? Is this your lipstick? Yeah. <laughs> no. What if you just go in, you know, like this? <laughs> well, and then... Yeah, there you go. And then, yeah, and then you can just use it and then put it back. Yeah, so it's a lipstick desk holder. Putting the eek in unique. I will say that is a great tagline for what this store sells. Yeah. It's just so yeah. weird, dude. I think it might be weirder than the toenails. I agree with you. I hate this video. <laughs> here, Sam, um, I th I'm gonna put this here. I've decided. You want me to move the toenails? <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh! Ha! No, dude, <laughs> what if that went in my mouth? Oh wait, we gotta... He's gotta breathe. Uh, absolute no. I'm just gonna go out on a limb here and say all these products today are nope. So just assume if I don't say it, it's gonna be a nope, okay? Next product. So Matt, this next product doesn't have... Stop smiling so much. <laughs> uh, it doesn't have a storefront because you basically work with them to custom create a Furby. So this is a custom Furby. Dear friend, thank you so much for adopting one of our custom made Furbs to give unappreciated plushies new life. Oh, so these are used? Oh my word, this, this is so long. I don't care. <laughs> There's so many things in here. So they sent some extra stuff as well. Oh, oh, that's so strange. <laughs> Oh, that's so weird. What is this? Why does this look like that Marvel character? I gotta say, this is definitely the weirdest Furby I've ever seen. Oh. No, this is the thing in in the uh, Shang Chi. The, oh, it does look like the little guy. This guy right here. That's this. Wow. That's actually this. But why would you put the Furby head on it? Well, because I think they try and combine a bunch of oh. like toys to try and make oh. unique custom builds. Oh, this is like weird Toy Story energy. You know the weird kid across the street. You're telling me Luna wouldn't like this? Luna would never see this. She'd <laughs> never be able to even like be able to witness this. I won't show her this video. I won't bring home this product. You're telling me that you don't... I don't what? I think this is cool. <laughs> There's like... too many Furbies things. But this is a unique Furby thing. What? Oh yeah, they, they threw in just some extra. Decorative aluminum wrap. <laughs> I'm just... so scared. Oh, that's too weird, what dude! What is it? Ah, no! <laughs> this is Sid energy, bro! I don't like that. Wait, wait. <laughs> wait, I want to put her. No! Matt, come on, this is cool. I think this might be the last Furby. That's just too strange, dude. What was that... this before they furbized it? But look at how cool this looks. You're telling me 
You wouldn't like this. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, you Sam. Don't this is this is the weirdest thing. That belongs on the pedestal right here. Oh, them together? Oh, them together. Bro, I absolutely can't stand that box. That box triggered me. Matt, turn around and look. <laughs> oh, it's staring at me, dude. What is that? The Barbie is the worst part. I kind of like the stuffed animal. <laughs> I'm not kidding. It's just so weird. Apple or Samsung watch charging. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just like a little hand. I like that it's mega green. That color has got, you know, warm spot in my heart. Okay, I had to cart. I'm just like not in my element today with <laughs> these products. Like, you know what I mean? Like usually I'm like laughing and gaffing and making jokes, but these things got me weirded out. Oh, it's red. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. That's weak energy, dude. So the, the Apple Watch charger goes in there. The Apple Watch goes on top of that. Would you use this? Like, is this something that you could see being in overkill land? No, definitely not. I think you'd have to tighten it, you know, like that. Does it even like support it if you stand it up? Huh. Yep, it works. It's just weird. It's just really strange. <laughs> <laughs> High five! <laughs> I feel like you could go too far with some jokes with this. Yeah, probably. <laughs> it's a very specific hand shape. You know, it's true. It's <laughs> just put it on someone's chair. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is pretty durable, dude. That didn't break. Oh, durable. For so, that, it gives a dope. <laughs> oh, wow. Is that the one dope? That's so the far? one dope, but that's only on the, you know, on the off chance you're a weirdo. Toilet paper earring, real toilet paper, weird earrings, crazy earrings, oddity earrings, <laughs> unique earrings, cool earrings, real toilet paper. Real toilet paper? What? <laughs> that looks like real toilet paper. Mother liked mine, so I bought her a pair. Dude, so this, so weirdos are made. I feel like there was a big explosion of like toilet paper themed products after 2020 because uh, obviously everyone rushed for toilet paper at the yeah. beginning. So I guess if you run out of toilet paper, this is gonna be a great option. Add to cart. Here we go guys, toilet paper earrings. Do you have ear holes? I do. You sure do. This is certainly real toilet paper. To be honest with you, that looks like it's a paper clip. <laughs> you know, I wouldn't wear it. <laughs> But Sam would. Do you think this is funny? Would you wear this? I have a handful of like quirky earrings. You know, I'm the type. Yeah, okay. I. <laughs> no one believes that. I... <laughs> What's weird is from a distance, these just look like long drop, like pearl earrings or something. Yeah. Like looking at yeah. them. They like... look like marshmallows. Yeah, but no one knows like you're a crappy girl. <laughs> Happy girl, did you really just, that's, <laughs> wow. I really thought that these were gonna be able to like unroll and so I started to tear them, oh. but they don't. That's the only thing that I thought would have made these like special weird is if you could like unroll that it been down cool. to here. Yeah, you ruined them though. I did? You straight up ruined oh, them. Oh, I thought you meant like me wearing them, <laughs> ruined them. I, just my existence? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's like little plies. Hold on. See? Oh no, look, this is legit actual toilet paper because there's, see, here's the perforation and here's the perforation. Oh. So this is a ply. They just like took. Toilet paper from their bathroom. <laughs> and just And like, you're wearing. Got it. I'm gonna say no. Okay, Nicolas Cage features on a wooden spoon. Pretty much says what it is, you yeah. know? Nick, Nick, yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> what would Jesus do? <laughs> this person thinks it's genius. 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 Add to cart. Morning. I'm about to serve you up some Nick Cage. <laughs> it's not big enough. Hold on. Here we go. That's it. Now it's Nick's cage on Matt's face. Nick's cage on Matt's face? <laughs> Nick's cage. What is that? <laughs> what does that mean, Matt? Nick's cage. <laughs> <laughs> Nick's cage on Matt's face. <laughs> I'm done, dude. <laughs> I'm done, bro. Oh, man. They didn't even do it right. It's like all like up to the right. Like at least center it, dude. Pay $9 for a spoon. That's actually kind of cheap. I just don't, like why? Like who's the type of person? I'm trying to like figure out who are these people buying these products. I know someone who is a really big Nicolas Cage fan and I think this is a gift for Nicolas Cage fans. Who needs Who's that? Spirits. Besides the one people. person in the world that you're oh, friends with. Are you kidding me? So many people like Nicolas Cage. Like, but like this, like Nicolas Cage? Yes. You just made that up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say this is a nope, dude. I used to get spanked with a spoon like this. It hurt. With Nicolas Cage's face? <laughs> Can you imagine? I just have forever scars of Nicolas Cage's face. <laughs>
Ooh, let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> Accountability banana. Weird gift. He's just an angry banana. <laughs> What am I watching? Oh, they have all different kinds. You put him places where you need to focus so that when you look at him, you feel bad. Oh, is that really what this is? If you don't have someone that's gonna hold you accountable, you need the banana to like be looking at you. What happens if you just forget the bananas there because it's an inanimate object? You like put the banana somewhere that you typically get distracted. Bro, that's not how ADHD works though. <laughs> you get used to the banana and you just forget it's there. Add this cute gift box for additional charge. <laughs> <laughs> exactly what it says. Judgmental fruit sculpture that is kind of creepy. Freaking amazing. <laughs> I feel like I'm being really judgmental in this episode, but at the same time, I also feel like I'm right. <laughs> We're seeking out strange things intentionally. <laughs> Guys, let me know down in the comments below. Are you a weirdo? <laughs> and how do you define weirdo? Because I call my daughter a weirdo. Like her father, add the gift box. What would you use to get things done? Do you use an accountability banana? Always watching, always judging. Seems to be pretty well made though. The thing for me is like inanimate objects are inanimate objects. Who was it? Bailey and the Elik robot. She was just like, I oh, was so cute, it's oh, this, it's that. that. It was just a piece of plastic to me. I, I think it's the second you add a face to something. Give me a marker. <laughs> Do you like this more than you did before, five seconds ago? Yes, it's much cuter. You think this paper is cuter? I think the paper is cuter because it has a smiley face on okay. it. Okay. Yes. Now, are you going to focus better? Uh, no, because that guy looks a little mischievous, you know? <laughs> hey, you don't really have to respond to that email right now. Okay, what about this? <laughs> is that like Dracula? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't... This is just a little piece of paper now. Yeah, it's just a normal piece of paper. Right? Yeah. Is he okay? It's just three lines. But yeah. I just drew three lines, that's it. But that's <laughs> someone who's clearly not okay. Oh no, what's going on? <laughs> Here, you can, you can figure it out. Thanks. <laughs> it's just, this wouldn't work for me at all. I'll be honest, I don't even think people would work for me. Like someone standing over me and being like, are you done yet? I'd be like, I'm gonna hurt you. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I say no. Novelty toilet earrings. Could you wear both together? Yeah, probably. To a toilet party, you know? Toilet party? Oh, you've never been? Stop. Toilet parties, I can't even. <laughs> I really like tried to commit to the idea of a toilet party. Oh, but I was like 50% believing you. You're because I know you and you yeah. go to like a party like three times a week. Yeah, so I love like, themes. And maybe a toilet party is like a consistent thing that she goes to. Style, avant-garde. Location, earlobe. Oh, okay, got it. It'd be funny though <laughs> if you had, <laughs> Never mind. Oh, oh, let me just buy these. Yeah. Add a cart. <laughs> Super zany. Oh, what? Ah! Ah, toilets. Yeah. <laughs> Anytime I see earrings like these, I think about like those like kooky teachers wear oh, weird yeah. outfits and stuff. But like, why toilets? You know, you're just going to class and you're like, what are they gonna do this time? You know, and they're just like, I'm zany. I don't want to be unique to the point where I'm wearing toilets. We'll move over. <laughs> <laughs> They're toilets. What do you want from me? Gosh, if you're coming here for formal reviews, uh, you know. Yeah, this is not the This place. is your problem, this is your fault. These do look fairly well made though. Like they are like cute little, like well made toilets. <laughs> yeah, so this is the toilet yeah. and this is the toilet paper. Does this, I don't know how I feel. I know how I feel. If I wore these into work <laughs> one day, what would your reaction be? I, I'd be like, wow, you're a zany girl. <laughs> That's what you'd say. And yeah. then I'd like, you know, avoid you the rest of the day. It's like a bait. You're yeah. like trying to get me to ask them. Absolutely. You know what I mean? <sighs> Where did you get those, Sam? And you're gonna be like, oh my I gosh, I went to a party last night, yeah, and then we did, you know, it was a story. toilet party, and we tried different toilets, and we all voted on the best toilet. Yeah. It was crazy. It was a crazy experience. Anyway, so uh, yeah, I don't know how I feel about these earrings. I think it's gonna be a nope. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's funny. What the heck is this, dude? Iridescent dragon egg. This is not like that weird. It's actually kind of cool looking, but it is a little strange. I don't really know what I'm feeling right now. What is this? Who's this for? Maybe this is like, you know, for like people that, you know, will, y you know. Yeah, find it, find it, you can. Y you know, they're like, it's where they're, and it's happening yeah. all around it. I think that makes sense. Yeah, I think I nailed it. Add to cart. <laughs> oh, walmart.com. 
I can definitely picture that they're shopping at Walmart. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> You're the one that said it. <laughs> Amanda, I'm gonna out you right now. But Amanda was like, you know what? Walmart has pretty cool clothes now. They actually do. <laughs> No, I'm not kidding. Like, they've improved. I've been shocked at what I've seen in the Walmart aisles these days. What the heck is this? What is this? We got a lot of different eggs. <laughs> you know, some days you wake up and you, like, you feel bad about yourself, you know? And you're just like, you know, I'm just kind of a weird person. And then you see this and you're like, dang, I must be popular. <laughs> this makes me happy for people that they, you know, have an audience for stuff like this. <laughs> there are people out there that buy their creations and yeah. that must feel good. So on camera, it looks so much better than it does in person. Very interesting. Did we get like a small one too? It's burning it. Ooh. That looks very pretty on camera. It's pretty creative to use push pins to make a dragon egg. <gasps> You're right. I did not catch that. Do you use the pushpin? I take one out. Does it still have the little buddy in it? Yeah. yeah. If we bring our favorite board right over. <laughs> Don't hurt him. How does it make you feel, Sam? Sad. And also people be strange, you know? I stand by that. <laughs> Do you then just take the pushpin out and put it back into the egg? I think it's just supposed to be an egg. Oh, you're not supposed to deconstruct it to use it? I think you're just supposed to look at it. You just look them. You know, you They're just have pretty. it on your shelf, you know, next yeah. to the mouth and the Furby creations. And then you invite your parents over and they're like, what happened, Sam? And you're right. just like, I am zany. Yeah. <laughs> you know what this whole video feels like? What? <gasps> this feels like, what's her face from New Girl? Jessica Day. Jessica Day. I will say I could see her like being like thumbtacks. Ooh, Ooh <laughs> thumbtacks. Yeah. So guys, that's, that's all the products today. So it, it definitely appears as though the Furby is the strangest thing that we found on Etsy. If you guys think there are some strange things on Etsy that you can find, not gross, okay? I'm not gonna be looking at gross or flesh things. There's plenty of that. But do suggest the strange things on our Reddit. Um, I'm actually gonna be looking at memes and products from the Reddit soon, so please do that, you weirdos. <laughs> and until then, um, click that video. All right. <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>